So I'm curious, Jimmy, that you might agree with that, like, it, that this doesn't accomplish much, and hence what's the point. But uh, does that mean that if it did accomplish more, you'd be in favor of it, or no? Like, no. So you're against it under all circumstances? So under all circumstances, I'm against it, because it's just more war, and there's no reason to it. Certainly not the reason they're giving us. Um, I have a hard time believing that Barack Obama gives a shit about the civilians in Syria. I really don't think he cares. And uh, like, because if he did care, if, if that was really this litmus test of innocent people, why wouldn't, why aren't we bombing North Korea? Why aren't we bombing? Because our we can't. And isn't that fair? Look, I'm going to take you guys on on that. Okay, because, so we can't bomb Russia if Russia uses chemical weapons because we don't want to start World War III. You're right. Absolutely. Yeah. Right? Okay, but why don't we take, you know, take the low-lying fruit? Okay, yeah. like send a message wherever we practically oh, okay. can. So North Korea, I'd right. love to decapitate all the leaders in North okay. Korea and set that country free. But we might lose Seoul, South Korea and millions mm -hmm. of people. Within we can't do hours. it, yeah. right? And mm -hmm. if we can do it in Syria and help some people, well, okay, that's a good place to start. Well, the reason why you can't selectively enforce the law is because it breeds disrespect and contempt for the law. So if you're trying to uphold international law selectively, you're doing the exact opposite. You're undermining international law because mm. we illegally invaded is, uh, Iraq and we a uh, million people were killed, displaced other millions, countless. How many thousands of innocent people were killed in that? That was an illegal war. We lied about it. Where's our... Where, if nobody kept us in check, somehow we have to still keep other people in check. I said it yesterday, you can't have Tony Soprano giving out parking tickets. It doesn't fucking work. Yeah, but if you... I don't know why Israel flipped on it, but they did. So is that part of our decision making? Have you been paying attention to American oh. politics? Of course it's part of our decision making. But I don't view that as nefarious. I view that as like, I don't know, like, uh, if, it, if you're Israel, Assad is never going to harm you. And so the fact that they're now saying we should attack Assad, I don't think that's a bad thing. 